the one thing a narcissist can't accept. The one thing they cannot accept is your freedom. They cannot accept that you have the power and right to act, speak and think as you want. You are free to think however you want to think and do whatever you want to do. But they don't want you to know that. They want to contain you in their box. They want to control you. They want to have influence and authority over you. If you think differently from them and you have your own thoughts, ideas or preferences, the narcissist will try to shut you down. They will try to prevent the development, action or expression of your feelings, impulses or ideas. They will see it as though what you're doing is wrong. And you will feel like you're not allowed to be a separate individual. Like you're not allowed to have your own thoughts, ideas and preferences. They ignore the fact that you are free. That you have the freedom to choose who you want to be because they don't want you to realize it. And if you knew that you are free, you could be whatever you want to be, rather than being whatever they want you to be. The narcissist doesn't like the idea of you being free. But just forget about the narcissist for a moment and ask yourself, do you like the idea of being free? Do you like the idea of being able to think, feel and act as you wish? rather than being under the control of another? Narcissists are very possessive and controlling. They demand your total attention. They are too dependent on you emotionally. So they need to be able to control their source of emotional dependency. They need to have the power to influence and direct your behavior and the course of events. So that they can contain you and keep you all to themselves. so that they can have a constant source of supply on tap 24 hours a day, seven days a week, whenever they want it. Which is why they are so against your freedom. They are so against you articulating your ideas and opinions. Your freedom gives you the ability to choose. It provides you with the opportunity to decide in a course of action. In life we have many different options. We have many different alternatives. And your freedom gives you the ability to choose which option you prefer.
it gives you the ability to decide how you want to live your life. The narcissist doesn't see any need for you to make your own choices and decisions. They've already got their own conceptions and beliefs. They've already got their own impulses and ideas. They think they've already got all of the answers to who you're supposed to be. They think they've already got all of the answers to what you're supposed to be doing. So they just expect you to look to them for the answers. Rather than making your own choices and decisions. They fail to notice that you have the freedom to choose who you want to be. The narcissist doesn't like the idea of you being free. They want you to do what they tell you to do. They want you to comply with rules, standards and expectations. They want you to filter everything through their opinions and preferences. Rather than you making your own choices and decisions through your own ideas and preferences. Maybe you want to spend money in a certain way. But the narcissist doesn't agree with it. So they start telling you how to spend your money. In that situation, what you should do is tell the narcissist that while you hear and understand what they're saying, you're going to honor and respect your ability to make your own choices and decisions. You have the privilege to choose how you spend your money. Because you have freedom. You get to choose who you want to be. But if you've been around the narcissist long enough, they will have trained you into seeking their validation on who you're supposed to be. That's how they have managed to contain you and prevent you from making your own choices and decisions. But when you're free, you get to ask yourself who you are. The narcissist doesn't like the idea of you asking yourself who you are. Because they think they've already got all of the answers. They want to tell you who you are. They want you to be whatever they want you to be. But you may think differently. You may have your own ideas and preferences. You may have your own interpretations. And as someone who is free, you should have your own independent thoughts and ideas. You should choose who you want to be. The narcissist may criticize you. They may try to persuade you to do something by using force or threats. But you don't have to go along with it. The narcissist will still be there trying to tell you who you are and what you should like. But you need to follow your own ideas and preferences. You can take their ideas into consideration. If 
they want to communicate them effectively. But if they're going to try to impose their opinions and preferences onto you, and try to coerce you into doing what they want, you don't have to entertain that kind of discussion. The narcissist will often make threats and make you feel like there's going to be consequences to your freedom. They will tell you they're going to punish you. They will try to make you feel miserable for even desiring to be free. But you get to decide what the consequences are going to be. If you choose to act on your own ideas and preferences and the narcissist doesn't approve of it, you're not going to be able to work together effectively. But you can still be true to yourself. You have to be okay with a narcissist criticizing and judging you. as long as you feel comfortable with who you are. You don't have to go along with that agenda. You can be free. And the narcissist is also allowed to be free. You can try to share your ideas and preferences with a narcissist. But if they want to be angry or upset, they're allowed to be that way. You're not responsible for how they think or feel. They are also allowed to be free. They get to choose who they are going to be too. And if they want to waste their lives away being miserable, that's on them. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. Check out the new Narc Survivor website at www.narcsurvivor.co.uk where you can read my blog posts, book coaching sessions, and join a support forum. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.